All right, guys, I was cruising the skateboard around and look what I ran into. Got some shovels, good spreader. Look at this old Husqvarna case. I'm assuming it's empty. However, I remember Andrew Camerata's video where he's like, I was driving down the road and I saw this chainsaw case on the side of the road with a free sign on it. I was thinking, oh, that's just a case. Don't want it. And then there ended up being a saw. So let's find out right now what's going on. Holy smokes, we got a soul in the box. Booyah! This guy was uh, uh -huh. one minute too late. Uh, really, a brand new chainsaw in the box. Uh, He's got a brand new chainsaw in the box. Uh, yeah, but no, it ain't, ain't really any metal now. Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, Look at this thing. This looks brand spanking new. So let's get it home and see what's going on with it. I'll probably grab these uh, shovels too. I got some straps, a tool belt, a saw, and a spreader to push it all home with on the skateboard. A couple other really good things in here too though. I mean like, you got some old VHS's that are probably gonna be worth big money one day. The total trolley. What else in here? Scooby goes Hollywood. Look at it. About half full, so I guess maybe it's been used. Bar oil's half full. Yeah, that's in good shape though. Even sharp. Not seized up. Could use a little low and high speed screw adjustment, but it runs like a top. Chain is way too tight too, so loosen that up a little bit. And that's pretty awesome. Good run and saw. This was kind of perfect because the one I kept in my truck before uh, got flooded when I sank my truck in the river. Let's see if this one will get started up though. It was actually uh, locked up because I let it sit for a day and didn't run it. Kind of least of my worries. Now look at that, the bulb just cracked on it. Definitely had some water in the fuel too. And this is one of those whole entire primer assemblies. It's like four bucks for a whole 10 pack of these primer bulbs. Unbelievable. We got weak spark. It only sparks if you pull it real hard. Two days later, let's see if this thing's dried out anymore. Actually, I guess I'll pull it over a couple times. Get some fresh air in there. I don't see any more water coming out. Bearings aren't locked up. Let's see, I'll choke it. Prime it. Spark plug lead on. <laughs> and here we go. Okay. Pretty warm out right now. Oh, come on. I'm not giving up on you.
that low screw a little bit probably there we go runs like a damn top alright well this can go in my pile of other chainsaws because you can never have enough chainsaws. <laughs> 